Hi there, I'm Stephanie and I'm an artist who uses Winsor & Newton materials which I discovered when I was a student. I'm going to be looking at different materials, methods and approaches and the archival importance of using good quality materials in your work. In this video I'm going to talk to you about the new dual colours created by Winsor & Newton including the introduction of smalt which was first known and used in the 15th century. These single pigment colours have been introduced to the range, known as the dual colours. Smalt here was first used in the 15th century and it was introduced to Windsor and Newton in 1890 by Taylor. This became obsolete and now we have this synthetic version which is a great addition to the palette with its cool transparent qualities. This amazing transparent orange creates an incredible luminosity with the paper Quinacridones were introduced in the 1950s, starting with magenta and rose, and now we have violet, which is a really beautiful extension to that fantastic family of colours. And then we have a cobalt green deep, comes from the cobalt family, and as you can see, adds a wonderful intensity to the greens and the blues already available. And then finally, this aqua green, which has an incredible turquoise strength and tone. These single pigment colours have been introduced to the range which add a perfect extension to any palette. You can see that like the rest of the range you have beautifully finely milled colour and means that even with colours such as the violets and the oranges you get really clean mixes. This makes a perfect addition to the range and indeed to your palette, particularly with the reintroduction of a historical colour such as smalt. And you can see that as all these colours blend into one another, because they're single pigments, they just add tone and depth rather than become muddy. 